Hello and welcome to this first opinion veterinary ultrasound case. So this was a boxer dog who was seven years old, female neutered. She had a history of inappropriate urination, vomiting, PUPD, polyuria and polydipsia, hematuria, proteinuria, and the vets had noticed that she had an abnormal right kidney on the scan but weren't sure what to do next with that. So here's what we found on the scan. I have to say her left kidney was absolutely normal, um, but here is her kidney. We can see somewhat normal structure here of the cortex, um, but then as we fan through, we can see um, the, the abnormal um, medulla stretching out here. So this is all uh, a mass within the kidney. Another view here. So we've got what looks like a fairly normal kidney there, but as we fan through, then we can see this abnormal mass stretching all the way down here. Um, quite heterogeneous mass, um, hyperechoic compared to the what the medulla should be, um, and, and very abnormal there. So again, a more or less normal cortex. It was difficult to get um, a, a good reading on Doppler because she was panting um, and um, the owners refused sedation, but we could see there was some um, vascularity to this mass here. Um, so we can see some vessels coming in here at the top. Okay, so really, some parts of the kidney looking normal. Um, we can see the, the um, caudalina cava coming across here um, and then this abnormal medulla here. We weren't able to fully rule out that the right adrenal was, wasn't involved in this. We could see the caudal pole of the right adrenal, but we struggled to see the cranial pole. Um, but the caudal pole of the right adrenal looked normal. Um, but um, we were more suspicious that with, this was a kidney uh, mass, um, not an invasive uh, adrenal tumour. Um, and we were able to take fine needle aspirates of this mass. So this right kidney has an associated mass, the cortex appeared normal and the mass extended from the medulla. We couldn't rule out an invasive tumour from the right adrenal. This was a mixture of gas getting in the way and not being able to access the right adrenal behind this tumour. We took a fine needle aspirate of the mass and that revealed a likely diagnosis but not a fully confirmed diagnosis of renal carcinoma and the plan was to surgically remove the affected kidney.